somewhere on uh, YouTube, some uh, some uh, buddy is advertising the world's smallest V8. Well, uh, this V8 that I built uh, is smaller than the world's smallest V8. This uh, our stock engine has a three-quarter bore and three-quarter stroke. It's a square engine, and it's eight-cylinder V8 traditional American-style V8. It uses uh, one-quarter 32 spark plugs from model airplane engines, and it has an uh, OS carburetor from, a, from an OS model airplane engine. Otherwise, it's entirely my own design. I've uh, purchased uh, very few standard parts, nuts, bolts, and screws, of course, uh, billet aluminum, machined it on my Bridgeport mill. Um, it has a steel ex exhaust manifold, a steel crank, brass uh, gears in the here for the uh, crankshaft, for the uh, camshaft, a uh, steel camshaft, has a, a distributor of my own design, distributor cap is made out of Delrin, um, uses a Hall Effect uh, sensor in the um, distributor with a uh, shutter to uh, facilitate uh, timing, eight uh, cylinders of course. Um, I named it uh, Victory 44 because it was a victory when it started and ran and it has 44 cc's of displacement. Um, spark bug wires are um, test lead wire from Radio Shack. Um, this is from a uh, cable that comes out of the uh, distributor sensor down to the electronic unit that's down in the base. Uh, it's uh, from a radio control uh, setup. It's ex a aileron extension. Um, of course the uh, feed for the fuel has to be up level with the carburetor in order to get proper feed so I've made a fuel tank up here and um, that's pretty much what I have. I will uh, put some fuel in it and see if I can get it to start. It uh, runs on uh, Coleman fuel and I put a little bit of oil in it to uh, lubricate pretty much uh, what one would refer to as premix. So we'll uh, turn it around here where it's a little handier. Turn the ignition on and give it a flip. Oops. Come on, honey. Well, that didn't start it. Sounds like a big American VA, that's what I had in mind. Um,
that's my version of the world's smallest V8.